fallout from the UCP convention and a controversial resolution on gay-straight alliances. We take general direction from the membership, but ultimately I'll be holding the pen on our platform. Live from Edmonton, CTV News with Daryl McIntyre and Aaron Some Isfell. mixed messages coming from the UCP following the party's first ever general meeting. Jason Kenney says, if elected, his party will not require parents to be no notified if their child joins a gay-straight alliance at school. That's even though party members supported the controversial policy proposal yesterday. Bill Fortier has more. Welcome and raise the roof for the Honorable Jason Kenney. Hey. The UCP leader getting a big reception as the party opened its first general meeting. Hi. Thank you very much. But by Sunday, an apparent rift between leader Jason Kenney and grassroots members. They voted in favor of a controversial policy resolution calling for parents to be notified if their child joins a gay-straight alliance. I am concerned and very disappointed that uh, this new party has uh, decided to focus on attacking these vulnerable groups. We are not going to require mandatory notification for a membership in extracurricular clubs. Kenny quick if, to oppose um, his party's resolution, school, suggesting that, a different approach from his grassroots policy guarantee in the summer of 2017. That you develop the policies of this new party and give the leadership its marching orders. The UCP leader was asked about the promise on today's CTV power play. Who's in charge? Well, I'm the leader and I'm in charge. You, the grassroots members, are in charge. Kenny says the promise was for drafting party policy, not the party's election platform. We take general direction from the membership, but Ultimately, I'll be holding the pen on our platform. This political expert says Kenny's response was a political gamble. So it's a strategic decision, but I, I think it's not without costs. So the difficulty is that he risks alienating members. Kenny's site, grassrootsguarantee.ca, is no longer active. According to Google, it was still up at least as recently as April 30th. Kenny blames it on an IT issue, saying the website is switching to a new vendor. Bill Fortier, CTV News.